Hello, ladies and gentlemen, my name is Kurt, and welcome, welcome back, actually, to Gravity Ghost. If you've been around for a little bit under a year on my channel, you might remember that I played a very early release of Gravity Ghost back in April of 2014. This is from Ivy Games. It is a uh, kind of a gravitational puzzle platformer. It releases on January 26th. If everything goes right, I'll be uploading this, excuse me, on the 25th while I'm currently away at PAX South. Uh, but it will be releasing on January 26th. And a few, a few items of business to get out of the way before we start playing here. Uh, when you buy it, when you buy Gravity Ghosts, it's two for one. Uh, in the description, they say it's it's for one of you, obviously, to use, and the other copy to give to somebody who maybe doesn't play games as much as you do, or maybe hasn't been introduced to indie gaming or the current generation of games. So, a very cool little system they've got going on there. And of course, if you do pre-order, if you see this video and it's before the 26th, if you can get ahead of time and pre-order, you get 33% off the pre-order price. And uh, let's actually start. Let's start playing. I'm going to do an actual let's play of this. Uh, the developer, like I said, Ivy Games. This is actually Aaron Robinson. Uh, I met actually back... I met her back in PAX Prime 2013. And uh, I was, I've been watching this this game come around and, and it's finally come around. It has finally come around indeed. I'm using a keyboard and mouse. It's actually the way Aaron suggested she prefers to play play it as opposed to with a controller. You can also play it with a controller if if you have a preference to playing with a console-style controller. And there's actually... there's actually seems to be a storyline, which there there didn't exist. <laughs> a storyline did not exist in the, the that very early build that I played back in April. And a lot has changed. A lot of the... the just the illustrations... The backdrops, everything. It's like a it's like a whole new game. The the marvelous music you hear, the soundtrack is by Ben Prunty, who also composed the music for FTL, Faster Than Life. Where are you going? It would appear that our wolf friend oh, I'm sorry, that's like a fox. Fox dog wolf type friend has vanished from us, and I think that's kind of the theme, is we have to find and recover the wolf. Uh, but yes, we we basically have these gravitational fields that hold us to little planets and stuff, and that's how you progress to the next level. Like I said, very much a, a platformer, puzzler sort of situation. <laughs> Very atmospheric. -y. Very, very, very difficult. <laughs> all right, -y. all right. Use real momentum. Use what you've learned in Kerbal Space Program, Kurt. Bloop. Clockwise, counterclockwise. Even one upside down. So that was that was the part. Oh, oh, this is new. Yeah, oh, okay. Uh, I kind of like the, the using the arrows or WASD. You can also you can also use your mouse if you wanted to. Eh. And I think she just follows the mouse. Oh, that actually, hmm. Yeah, it's a little bit disorienting. I feel like I should be switching to the other way, but it's either clockwise or counterclockwise, even when upside down. It's not, it's not based on your position, it's just, it's always constant. Whether or not you travel clockwise or counterclockwise. I, I'll, I'll, I'll keep with the keyboard, I'll keep the mouse out of the way for now. Boing. Oh, literally boing. Literally boing. Whoa, okay, alright, alright, let's, let's recover. <laughs> We've reached escape velocity here. So yeah, there's different, uh, looks like there's different, ah, oh dang, there's different uh, mechanics with each of the, oh dear, each of the globes. 
All right, stop it. I want to try to get to the door. Getting the star was the easy part. Getting to the door is proving to be very difficult. Hey, go, go. No, no, keep going. Yep, here we go. Yep, yep, uh, uh, all right. Get to the, the, the Lagrange point <laughs> to, to neutralize your gravity. Flowers make your hair longer, and there's some sort of broken ship. Holy ship. Hair lets you carry animal spirits. I mean, obviously, that goes without saying. All right. Oh, very. Yeah, that's that's new. I think I don't remember that from the uh, the pre-build that I had played before for review. All right, here we go. Now we found we found the uh, the map as to how we get through here. So space is to select your level. Got it. Oh, there's a rabbit. And there's catch the en oh, it's like following me. So I'm playing as both the rabbit and myself. Oh, this is ha! Get back! Oh, that's strange. Oh, there we go. I guess I got it. Carry the spirit to its body. Well, that's an interesting mechanic. Oops! Dang it. It's kind of like the uh, <laughs> the levels of Tomb Raider with the. The doppelganger. <laughs> you gotta do the exact opposite. Welcome to the afterlife. Here is your hug. That was okay. So there's a. Oh my. Okay. I guess we should grab all these flowers. We are some sort of gravity ghost, <laughs> if you will, who returns animals to the afterlife. Yoink! I just unlocked a steam achievement. I'm fabulous, is what it was. I suppose referring to the hair length. All right, let's try to... There we go. Oh, we're going the wrong way, but I'll use that. Escape velocity! Oh, let's get that one, and there's one more over in the middle. Wow, it, that, it's gotta be one heck of a tangle to, to unknot in the morning, eh? This is so great. My parents never let me have a treehouse. They never let me hunt these woods neither. But here we it's are. Generic B, everybody. Sal, are you a poacher? <laughs> me? Nah. I just like to sleep under the stars with a rifle and shoot things to sell. Hey, want some ham? <laughs> what did I tell you? You can't bring <laughs> that is generic B. Why not? You never know what a wild animal is capable of. And mark my words, food will bring them nothing, even all the way up here. Okay. There's a good lass. Safety for... <laughs> oh, blast it! My good thumb! My good thumb. Good thing you have two of them left. Hey, where's that third one? Uh, <laughs> let's... Let's see here. I wonder if there's a way. Hold on, let me check if there's a way to turn on subtitles. Subtitles, of course. Subtitles is on. Uh, that is not the resolution I'm playing at, but we'll just pretend that it is. And let us return to the game. All right. So now we get to hear what the ghost of Jack B is saying. Bowling for the stars. Yeah, I'm gonna be planning on doing an actual let's play of this, but I'll just be recording this one video for now. Because, like I said, I will be going to PAX South, and I just want to make sure I'm not getting too far ahead of myself with getting too many series is going on at the same time. Do I have to... I'm assuming bowling means I should knock down all the pins. I actually went bowling recently, and uh, played three games. The third of which, I finally broke 100. So I'm terrible at bowling. <laughs> so if you ever want to hustle me out of some dough, just challenge me to a, a bowling match. Is that what they're called? <laughs> oh, I'm terrible. All right, let's try to... I'm assuming you got to hit these with some force. Dang it! All right, here we go, here we go. Get taken out, you dang glass planets. Oh, dang it.
Huh, what do I gotta do to take out these glass planets? Or, or is this... Take that! I'm assuming I'll get some additional... Oh! Flowers? Take that! Oh, that's the way to do it. You gotta... Fake it out. I'll get some additional points or flowers for... Doing everything. Bam! Bam! Alright, here we go. We're about to find out. Ah! Oh, I just missed it. Alright, let's try to come back around. Alright, here we go. Here we go. Here we go. Here we go. Nope, I messed that up totally, completely. Ah! So this is a very peaceful game, may I remind you, as I'm struggling to destroy... Oh, this planetary body. Oh my gosh, I'm just, I'm stuck in, in the Lagrange point again. <laughs> uh, I, don't, I don't think, I don't think this game uses quite the sophisticated... Oh, come on, that was fast enough. Gravity simulations that, say, your Kerbal Space programs do. Oh, I didn't. Oh, it was all for naught. It was all for naught. Not to be confused with that crazy game knot that I just played, but... Alright, that was kind of just learn learn the mechanics of that situation. Ah, here's where stuff starts to get a little bit complicated. Uh, oh, that was unexpected at best. Alright. Alright, let's flow down to the middle. There we go. Oh, whoa, I'm getting pulled away here. Yaus! Oh, oh dear. Alright, there we go. I'm taking a detour to the spinning star. Okay, there's a bunch of... Oh, okay. Okay, I kind of remember... I think this level was part of the... Uh, I don't think that rabbit thing was, but I think this level was part of the... Preview, preview part, the preview game that we played back in April. Wow. Well, it's gotten much more difficult, I think. Whoa. Oh, I suppose I could just take a ride. Could I not? Oh, oh, maybe not. Oh, actually, yeah, this whole movement thing is preventing me. Loop. Whoops, oops. Oh wait, grab it! Oh, dang it! So yeah, there's no... One of the things in the description of the game is that... Uh, there's no... Oh, I almost... Oh, I would have had it had I not jumped. You noob. There's no actual, like, fail states. You can't die. I'm sure you can get stuck, like with most puzzle games, but... It's kind of meant to be... A, a relaxing kind of play through a game. I think it's not a, a very long game, but we'll, I think, get a handful of episodes, hopefully, out of it. Uh, let's check out what's going on in the terrarium. Oh. Oh, we gotta break through all these. Got it. Take that. And that. And that. Ooh. Going for the hat trick. Oh. Without touching the ground. Yes. Let's do one more. Here we go, here we go. Yes! Ooh, and then we gotta bust through the one to the door. Like that! Alright, but first... I think there's some sort of spirit animal I think I can... find the bones to. Alright. Hi! How do I save you? <laughs> huh. Let's get that last flower. It's mine. Got a flower addiction. They're natural. It's it's from the earth. Ah, uh, it's funny because that's what people say about pot. <laughs> All right, I'm stuck again. I'm stuck. Let's float back. There we go. Come on, gravity. Come on, gravity. There we go. All right. Huh. I don't know what uh, 
what happened there with the terrarium. I feel like that would have been a place to save an animal or something, but... Bubble bounce! Oh, there's bubbles and then bounces. Oh! That was surprising. <laughs> Ping pong, not ping pong. Uh, pinball, pinball, pinball. That's the word I'm looking for. Little pinball mechanics going on here. Ooh. Hope that was unintended. Unintended gravitational reentry. There's one more. I'm not sure if. Yeah, I guess. I guess there isn't anything for me to actually gain from destroying all the bubbles. Alright, let's go back to the door. Hey! Okay. Not what I wanted. No, no. There we go. There we go. Soft landing, soft landing, re entry, and there we go. <laughs> Heavy heart. Alright. Is this like a boss battle or something? Free, free the geome. It's pulled towards you. Oh, okay. Do I? I think I do remember something. No, no, that's that's the wrong way. Oh, you income poop. <laughs> I'm not very good at mazes. I don't know if I'll fall in the maze or not, but ah, I keep jumping over as if I will. Okay, no, I won't. I'm not gonna fall in the maze, so I don't gotta worry about that. This is kind of crazy. This is like one of those. Oh no, 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 don't no, dang it. One of those 3D uh, maze puzzles that you see, at, like toys places. All right, I've got to make it just ever so slightly. Uh, there we go. I am so smart. S M R T. Explosions. Do I have to go get that? Can I go get that? Ha! All right, let's get a little bit more. We, have, we need to uh, increase our apoapsis. There we go. Yeah! Hold down for heavy mode. Let go to fall normally. All right, let's try to... Oh, okay, that's interesting. Oh, I see, that was... What was that, supposed to be like a diamond or something? And diamonds are heavy? Wait, no, what? Bam! That, that'll be helpful in the future, I suppose. Breaking those glass globes. Heavy heart. Heavy heart! I I understand the, the references to words. Uh, let's go back to the star arena. Whoa, she's quick. There's a paw there. Is this where my dog is located? No, that's something else. Alright. Oh, oh, I gotta capture this guy. Somehow. Oh, come back! Kick, 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 kick! There we go, alright. Do I have to capture this guy? I think I do. Yes, got him! Got him! Oh! Wow, get. Get ganked by my flowing locks of gankitude. Alright, let's, uh. Wow, this one is going way too fast. I'm getting. I'm getting sick! Alright. No, no, counterclockwise is where I want to go. Yep, nope. <sighs> Alright, we did it. Oh, oh, is this the guy who's in the other level? Oh, that's interesting. You, you gotta jump from level to level. Alright, I'm trying, I'm trying to land on that thing. So I can get those flowers. There we go, alright. This is gonna be a little bit of a trip we're taking here, but... Wow, that's interesting. Okay, I didn't even consider that mechanic. Yoink! It's a, it's like a, it's a badger. Mm, badger, badger, badger. <laughs> oh, I apologize. I've been on the internet for a long time, my friends. To have known what that is. All right, I think I got all the flowers I can get. So let's get out of here and get you back to your bones. I'm assuming. Yeah, all right, so let's... This is probably this guy over here. So if we go into the terrarium, will I still have... I will! Oh, but now I gotta redo this whole situation. All right, well... I've gotta keep that in mind now, I guess. 
Boom! Oh, hey, I've got heavy mode enabled. You look like a cuddler. And a biter. <laughs> I call the big one bitey. Uh, jokes. Oh my, okay. How much longer can my hair get? Holy crumbs, whoa! All right, I'm gonna be accidentally hitting down. All right, yep, heavy mode, blah, blah, blah. Oh, didn't mean to do that. All right, let's, let's oh, nope, 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 yep, yep, yep. All right, that's, all right, well, I gotta go this way. Let's try to get on the right trajectory, and I did not do such a thing. Bam, get busted. Myth busted. Oh, dang. Oh, got that one, got that one. Whoop, I'm going out beyond the edge of the universe. Like, go counterclockwise. I'm still getting that a little bit mixed up. Can I just do one of these quick jobbies? No, no, go back to the planet. Ah! Oh. All right, coming back down. All right, I'm, I'm, I'm getting... All right, I can leave at any time. <laughs> I'm, I'm in complete control of my... There we go. This, this addiction to these flowers. Now, yeah, there's no difficulty setting either, so... Whatever happens, happens, I guess. It's not... To... Oh, any fault of my own. I'm, <laughs> I'm getting rid of all of my... Uh... Any criticisms of my gameplay right there. Get that one. Oh, that's the new one. Here we go. Here we go, here we go, here we go. Oh, nuts. It switched on me. Alright. Gravity mode. No, 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 no. Oh, dang. <laughs> dang. Dang floaty. Get floated upon. Ha! Boo. All right, land, land. All right, let's try this one more time. I just want to get that one, because that's one from the badger. Dang it, badger! All right, there's, there's a very bright light coming from the door, saying, hello, stupid. This is how you get out of the level. Yeah, I got it. Oh, nuggets, nuggets, I say. Here we go, here we go, got it. Yeah, all right, now we can, with a clean conscience, continue on here. Oops, I've had the mouse on the screen the entire time, I'm sorry. There we go. Oh, and uh, another cutscene for you. His name is Boy. This cat is ugly. Come here, ugly cat. Not a cat, you kid. Look at me. That look, right there. It's okay, he's friendly. Pepper, go inside. Aww. Is this about the fox? He could have killed her. But he wouldn't have. He is a wild animal. Oh, those... Go to your room right now. Those, those subtitles are pretty quick. Gone. No, mom is gone. Because of your stupid boyfriend. I'm sorry. Go to your room and stay there until I know what to do with you. <laughs> Gotta lift some weights. There's a big barbell in the background. I know it's a windmill. Those Go are like the mills. <laughs> but they look like a giant barbells. Ah, <laughs> oh, that's pretty funny. Sorry. Oh, man. <laughs> it's the only thing I was thinking during that entire cutscene. All right, so we got... We saved that badger. Let's Let us break free, and then I think I will break the end of the episode. Oh, this is going to be interesting. Oh. Get broken! Get broken! Oh. Nope. Can't do it. Nope. There we go. That's the way to do it. Unleash your inner shard of diamonds. 
Oh, okay. Oops. I know there's a way eventually to, like, double jump. Alright, I'm gonna assume, since I've done it before, that you don't actually have to break all those things. Yeah, there's a way to, like, double jump or speed up your jump. Oh, let's do the... The Salamand Guardian. Sounds like a boss battle. And then we'll end the episode, and uh, I will announce how, uh, like I said, I you get two for one codes, so I can. Uh, oh God, I'll, I'll I'll give you my second code, in, in a way, but you have to wait till the end of the episode here. Ugh. Whoa, Nelly, you really startled me. Whoa, Nelly. Are you supposed to be. I think I'm a ghost now. Oh, I'm a guardian, one of seven. Yep. Together we protect the. Uh oh. In there used Sounds a lot like the generic bee character. He's even got the same kind of hair. Is this, is this, it's gonna be some sort of. Um. Okay, bad news first. The planet exploded. Black hole situation. Black hole situation. You, you can uh, collect the pieces of the planet. Yes, yes, this will work. And put them back where they belong. You want me to collect pieces? Correct. Uh, there might even Whoop. be survivors. Have you seen a ghost fox? Not if he came by during my nap. You are really bad at this. Yes. You're dang, dang lazy guy. You're so lazy you got grass grown on your head. Alley -oop. Is this the thing I gotta get? Oh. I appear to have grabbed a tree. And it's following me. Okay, so. Oh my. So I've, I've apparently grabbed part of a planet and we're going to go into a black hole at some point? This should be interesting, but I'll do that in the next episode. And look at all we have to look forward to! Holy heck! Got all these constellations to get through. So yeah, thank you very much for watching. My name is Kurt. And like I said, if you'd like to get that second Steam code, you need Steam for, for what I have. Uh, that came with my copy of Gravity Ghosts. You're gonna need Twitter. This is the best way I could think of doing this. So on Twitter, this video gets posted when it goes public on YouTube. Go to my Twitter account and simply reply to that tweet, and then from that series of replies, I will randomly select with a random number generator a winner, and you have to be following me on Twitter, because then I'm going to DM you, direct message you, the Steam code, so you yourself can play Gravity Ghosts. Thank you so much for watching. My name is Kurt. I've accidentally entered the level. No, no, I don't want to do this. Go back to map. <laughs> Spoiler alert. Spoilers. <laughs> Uh, my name is Kurt. Thanks so much for watching. I will see you next time.